Kitty cats. We're cute. But I'm cuter. Me wow. Nap time. One day, the kittens were visiting Grandma. Now then, little kittens, it's time for your nap. You can get some lovely rest right there in your nice new hammocks. Nap time? But naps are for little babies. Oh, we wanted to blow bubbles after lunch. Yeah, that's way more fun than sleeping for an hour. Little ones, it's good to have a nice, healthy rest. Come along, you might just have a great idea in your sleep. For example, one time a well-known scientist dreamed up a wonderful invention whilst he was sleeping. And it became a very famous scientific discovery. One very famous artist would lay down to sleep and then wake up and paint the extraordinary and crazy things he dreamed about. <laughs> wow, I love that! Cool! I say let's nap! So awesome! Me wow, me wow, me wow, me wow! Sleepy at all. I'm not either. Huh? <sighs> well, it's not too late to go back to our original plan. <laughs> Why aren't you sleeping? Well, because, uh... Oh, the mosquitoes are bugging us. Grandma hung up special nets to protect the kittens from insects. The mosquitoes won't bother you any longer. Sleep well, kittens. We have to find a place to blow bubbles where Grandma won't be able to see us. <laughs> <laughs> My kittens. Huh? You're still not sleeping? Well, um, you see, the ducks are keeping us up. That's right. With all their quacking and quacking, how could we sleep? Oh, I guess they must be hungry. We need to find some food for them. <laughs> Now then, the ducks won't bother you two at all. But Cookie and Candy didn't want to take a nap. Cookie, candy, pudding, Daddy's here. Keep it down. The kittens are taking a nap. <laughs> Doesn't look like they are to me. Sorry, Grandma, but we don't need naps anymore. They're really just no use at all. You're wrong about that. Guess what? While I was sleeping, I came up with a way to blow a whole bunch of bubbles at one time. Genius! <laughs> I know what we should do next time. We should actually sleep when Grandma says it's nap time. Then maybe we'll dream up some really great ideas. So awesome! Me wow, me wow, me wow, me wow! And that's how the kitty cats realize that taking a little rest during the day is very useful and good for you. The Sock Puppet Saga. One day, Mommy brought up a big box from the basement. Take a look. This box is full of your old toys. Hooray! I can't wait to play with all of them! 
First, you have to look through all of these and then decide which toys you want to keep and which toys to give away. Once you're done with that, you can play with them. So awesome! Me wow, me wow, me wow, me wow! <laughs> look at this! It's Cheeky, my old sock puppet! Hello! Mommy told us many stories about Cheeky, how Cheeky would eat all the sweets. And he sneaks and tugs on kittens' tails in the night. Cookie, we're trying to sort through toys here. Your stories really aren't helping. Hey, I'm helping out. Like, for example, I've decided Cheeky stays. Yep, yep. Ow! Oh, cookie, that hurt. Stop! I'm not Cookie. I'm Cheeky. No, you're not. You're just my brother with a puppet. Oh, hey, Cookie, stop that! I'm Cheeky. Try and catch me if you can. <laughs> Looks like we'll have to catch Cheeky if we want to get our work done. Huh? Track Cheeky down! Detective Bowtie always gets his puppet! <laughs> Detective Bowtie and Sheriff Sweetie set out to find Cheeky. as always, and the detective and the sheriff were both chasing it. They were chasing very fast, so they didn't see the ball. Huh. Are you telling me that socks with buttons for eyes are to blame? Yeah! Uh. I didn't have any idea that sock puppets could do such things. Does that sound right to you, Kitten Mitten, my kitchen mitt puppet? It was just Kitten Mitten doing it. La, 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 bla. Um, sorry, Mommy. It was us who broke the bowl and made this mess. I guess it's probably better if we put Cheeky and the detectives away. <laughs> I have a really good idea. We should clean up the mess and stop blaming the sock puppets for what we did. When we're done cleaning, we can put on a puppet play. Now that is a wonderful idea, Candy. Kittens, it is really important that you take responsibility for what you do. And don't dump the blame onto someone else, especially an old sock. <laughs> the kittens finished cleaning up and found another use for their puppets. <laughs> <laughs> I think this wonderful show could use another character or two. Don't you, Kitten Mitten? My goodness, but you're a handsome cat. Yeah, Sir Goofy uh, McPook. <laughs> so awesome! <laughs> me wow, me wow, me wow, me wow! The kitty cats and their parents had a lot of fun performing their puppet play. Kitty Fun Fair. One day, an exciting traveling fun fair came to town. We're headed to a real life fun fair. Oh boy, this is going to be the best day ever. We should try every single ride there. It's a shame that the fair is only here for one day. Kittens, don't worry. We'll all have a really wonderful time. Right. We'll take pictures after every ride so we'll never forget the fun time. So awesome! Me wow, me wow, me wow, me wow! Cookie wanted to ride the roller coaster with the really big loops. Hmm, I'm sorry, little fella, but this ride isn't suitable for kittens. You have to be taller than this to ride it. 
But what if I crawled up on Pudding's shoulders so that huh? we'd look as tall as a grown-up? Well, you are taller, but you still look too young. Hmm? Whoa. 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 We can make mustaches and beards out of cotton candy so everyone thinks that we're grandpas! It's not about how old you are, but how tall. If you're too short, the seatbelt won't hold you in. Whoa! Whoa! <laughs> that is very not safe. Let's go to the fun house with the crazy mirrors that makes us look wobbly. That'll cheer us up. <laughs> 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 Happy pieces for the picture album. I didn't huh? find that very fun at all. Huh? Well, first my tail looked enormous, then it was too little. Then I looked all wonky and crooked. <laughs> yeah, fun house. There's more attractions over there. Look, we must ride the adorable ducks. No way. Let's try that haunted house there. Is it really scary in there? No way! It's the coolest! Yeah? Okay, then. Well, then I'm going to ride the ducks. All right, have fun, kittens. Daddy and I will wait here. We'll take a nice photo of your smiling faces when you're back. Ah, <laughs> 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 oh, that spider's just made of plastic. <laughs> and that snake's just made of rubber. <laughs> <laughs> and now for the picture! Well, we don't seem to have any happy pictures so far. I was very scared. I wanted the ducks to go fast. Nothing was real on that ride. There are more attractions over there, darlings. <laughs> My phone battery ran out. Attention guests, the huh? traveling fun fair will be closing huh? soon. <gasps> and we still haven't got a photo where everyone is happy. And the fun fair is moving on tomorrow. <laughs> I have a really good idea. We just need to find a ride that everybody will like, even if we can't take a photo. Yeah. The kittens and their parents decided to ride the Ferris wheel. <laughs> Wow, we're really high. It's sort of scary, but it's really cool as well. And it's really beautiful. Ha <gasps> <laughs> ha, Cookie looks like someone's grandfather. At least now you can get on the rides that are just for grown-ups. <laughs> <laughs> oh, looks like we'll get our picture after all. Everyone, now we have a happy picture for the Fun Fair album. And we are all smiling in it. Yeah, but Daddy blinked, though. Oh, no, I've ruined the whole thing. I think we have time for one more ride, and we'll get another chance at the picture. Awesome! Me wow, me wow, me wow, me wow! <laughs> the Ferris wheel turned out to be the kitty cat family's favorite ride and helped make the trip to the fair a really special happy being together memory for them all. Forgive and forget. One day, the kittens decided to build a model of their home. Candy drew a pretty diagram of the house. Kittens, that's a wonderful idea. I can sew little doll versions of the family, and they can live in the little model house. So awesome! Me wow, me wow, me wow, me wow! Mommy and Candy went to the store to get some colored paper. Right, come along. I'll find you some cardboard, some glue, and scissors. Cookie and Pudding worked on the frame of the house following Candy's diagram. My half of the model's done, and it's awesome. All that's left is to cover it with colored paper. Oh. No, Cookie. <coughs> you just ruined a very important part. Well, would you like to crush part of my half of the model? That'd be kind of fair, right? Sure, all right. Huh? Why'd you have to break my roof? That's way harder to fix than the part I broke off yours. Uh, how about you cut off one of the walls of mine? All right. Oops. The, all right, now do I get to destroy your half of the house model? No. Just let me think for a minute. 
I'll find a way to make it up to you. Cookie offered Pudding his favorite, tomato juice. So now are we even? <sighs> I don't think so. I don't really like tomato juice. I like apple juice much better. Then I gave up my juice for nothing at all? Uh, well, do you think we'd be even if I gave you my candy? Ah, it's a deal. I like candy very much. Let's go finish the house. Just wait a minute. Your half of the model is still fine, and plus, you got the candy. My house half is just rubble. All I got was that juice I don't even like the flavor of. No fair. <laughs> well, then what if I gave you my ship? But my ship's really awesome. It's way cooler than half of a model. What if I trade my magnifying glass to you? But wait, I love my magnifying glass so much. I could give you something besides that, or do something for you instead. Cookie and Pudding tried making it up to each other by giving gifts and doing nice things. Some great colored paper. <gasps> Why'd you splash paint on my drawing of the house? I worked really hard making that. We're sorry. We apologize. Is there anything we can do for you to make it up? If you want, you can have my ship. My magnifying glass, too. I can push you on a swing for a long time. And then I can give you my dessert. This way we could really make it up to you. All right, stop, stop, stop. If someone you know does something wrong by mistake, you just need to work to fix that. Isn't that right, Candy? Yes, that's right. I have a really good idea. Pudding and Cookie, I don't want you to do anything. You had me the second you said you're sorry. I forgive you. Oh, wow, that was simple. Pudding, I absolutely forgive you. <laughs> I absolutely forgive you too, Cookie. Well done. We'll work up a nice new diagram and build another house. So, so awesome! Be wow, be wow, be wow, be wow! And that's how the kitty cats realize that they have to forgive each other for making mistakes so everyone in the little house could live happily and help each other. Renovations. One day, Mommy and Daddy brought home some wallpaper and buckets of paint. Daddy, what are you doing with all those things? Daddy and I have decided we're going to finish the attic. We'll make it all nice and cozy. The attic? Really? You mean that we're going to have a new room in the house? So awesome! Me wow, me wow, me wow, me wow! Hey, we can use the attic room for chess tournaments! Dance parties! Oh, we can play so many games up there! <laughs> oh. Come on, let's go take a look at the new room! <laughs> <laughs> It's still the same as before. Cookie, we only just started. First we figure out the plans, then we prepare them. I suggest we bring everything up from the basement so we don't have to run up and down the stairs every time. That's excellent thinking, darling. Little ones, remember to be careful when you go back down the stairs. It looks like we won't have a new room for a long time. Let's help Mommy and Daddy put up the wallpaper. If we hurry, we can do it all before they get back upstairs. Yeah, let's. It doesn't look very hard at all. Well, you're on a roll. Let me give you some help with that. 
There! It's not rolled up anymore. It's flat. Now we can stick it to the wall. Uh, oh! Whoa! I accidentally splashed this glue everywhere, and now the floor has been wallpapered. Maybe I can pull some of it up? Oh! 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 These silly, sticky things are way more trouble than they're worth. Oh. What if we just used paint on the walls? Yeah, let's. I'm pretty sure we could handle that. Oh. What is happening up here? Mommy, Daddy, we're so sorry. We just thought that we could help speed everything up. We just really wanted to help out. But it really didn't turn out that great. <laughs> Thank you for trying to help, my darlings. But you know, renovations are really tricky. All the preparation is hard, even for us grown-ups. Mommy and I know this very well. It's not our first renovation. I've got a really good idea. If you can teach us how to do all of this, then we can help you. That's a good idea, Candy. But first, you need renovations of your own. Huh? You're all taking a bath right now. After their bath, the kittens help their parents to renovate the attic. <laughs> Look at that! I thought it was going to take much longer to get all this done. It's all thanks to our students here. Because of your help, we finished much sooner than we expected. So awesome! Me wow, me wow, me wow, me wow! Hmm, but it still sort of feels like there's something missing. Oh, and what's that, oh? darling? Oh. Daddy messed up the wallpaper! Oh no. Now I know what it still needs. Some lovely kitty cat oh. paw prints. <laughs> <laughs> and that's how the kittens help their parents with renovations and turn the attic into a cozy room for the whole family. Cookie takes a break. One day, Daddy made an exciting announcement. My kittens, today we're visiting an aquarium. We'll see all kinds of fish and octopuses. So but first, you need to pick your train track up off of the floor. In case it causes a toy train kitten collision. <laughs> we'll clean up now. Sounds wonderful. And Daddy will buy our aquarium tickets online. We built such a gigantic train track that it'll take us forever to put it away. Well, we'd better get started then. <laughs> Tidying up wasn't Cookie's favorite thing to do. Uh, uh, uh. Cookie, can you put the controller in the box? It's too heavy for me. Uh, uh, uh. Cookie, did you drop that heavy train switch on your paw? Uh, yes, ow, yes. Dropped it right on my paw. Oh, it hurts so much. I guess I can't help tidy up. Right, when you injure your paw, you really should go lie down. However, just lying there and waiting was pretty boring. Cookie! Ouchie! Get off your paw or it'll never oh. get better. But I'm thirsty. I'll get you something to drink. And if you need something else, just tell us and we'll help you. Cookie started to rather like that having a sore paw made everyone help him out. He started calling pudding and candy for every little thing. I'd love to have an apple. Uh, on second thought, I'd love a pear more. Then Puss in Boots asked the princess. Are you feeling any better? Nope, my paw's still hurting. Shouldn't we tell Mommy? 
We shouldn't bother Mommy about one little sore paw. What if she sends me off to the hospital? <laughs> <sighs> should put some ice on your paw. Please don't do that. I'd probably catch a cold from all the ice. Achoo. If we had a time machine, we could use it to return to earlier. Mm. And keep Cookie mm. from hurting his oh. paw. Oh. Ah. Ah. But there's no such thing as a time machine. I'm sure my paw will get better on its own, but not yet. Hey, I think some cartoons would really help. Look, kittens, I just printed out our tickets to the aquarium. Ah! Oh! Uh. Daddy! Ah, goodness, looks like dear old Daddy just had a major train collision. The bruise isn't too bad, but Daddy cannot drive anywhere today. Now, kittens, why didn't you clean up like we asked you to? We were cleaning, but Cookie dropped the control box right on his paw. Then he started caring for Cookie instead. Um, to be honest, the box didn't really fall on my paw. Um, and my paw didn't really hurt at all. But why did you tell us that it was hurting? Well, at first it was because I really didn't want to help clean up. But then I really liked it that you were taking such good care of me. It's your fault we can't go to the aquarium today because Daddy's hurt his leg on the train set. <laughs> I'm really, really sorry. We're still going to go. I can drive us all there. And Cookie won't be doing anything like that again, will you, Cookie? I won't. Never again. I promise. I'm sorry, Daddy. I know what to do. Before we leave, we should clean up the rest of the railroad tracks so no one else gets injured. So, so awesome! Me wow, me wow, me wow, me wow! Cookie was a good kitten, to tell the truth. And he realized it's best to help out and not just think about yourself. Squabbling kitties. One day, Daddy suggested that the kittens play a board game. Look at this, kittens. Ah. And this game can be played by several players at once. There's no way that you could get bored with it. Mommy and Daddy have some things to take care of. But you can play the game together in the meantime. So awesome! Me wow, me wow, me wow, me wow! Okay, I'll take the first turn. But Cookie, you go first every time. Let me be first for once. No fair, I never get to go first. Let me! But I'm faster, so I should be first. Oh. Huh? Me, I'm first! <laughs> 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 the kittens didn't want to let each other go first. <laughs> Woohoo! That was awesome! All right, it's your turn. Well, I'm done. I am not going to play with you anymore. I'm not either. Is that right? Well, in that case, I'm not playing with you two. So I'm going outside to play with my ball. The kittens thought that they would be happier without their siblings. I'm going to have so much more time to make wonderful dresses for my dollies. I'll come up with my own fashion collection and everyone will love, love, love it. And I'll become a great fashion designer. <laughs> now I can devote myself completely to science and study cool stuff like plants and mushrooms. And I'll go everywhere in the world and discover all kinds of awesome things. Oh. <laughs> now I'll have lots more time to practice soccer. I'll become the captain of a famous team. Then we'll win the world championship. Ah, and win a giant trophy. <laughs> But then, the kittens realized that something was missing. Oh, I really wish Cookie and Pudding were here to see this. Yeah, I really wish I could share this with my brother and sister. Celebrating a win with Pudding and Candy would be just so awesome. Me wow, me wow. Wow. 
What are you doing? Oh, nothing. I just wanted to take a look at the game board. Oh. Um, are you having fun all by yourself? Sure, it's awesome. The most fun ever, ever. I'm having all the fun in the world. Huh? Huh? Boris came over to huh? visit the kittens. Who's there? It's Boris. Hi, Hi there, there, Boris. Boris. Hi, guys. Boris, come play a game with me. No, come play with me, Boris. We'd have way more fun if you played with me. Why don't we all play it together? We decided that we're never playing together again. Because someone always wants to be the one that plays first. Yeah, or getting offended by everything. We were fighting the whole time. I don't have any brothers or sisters at home, so I came to play with all of you, but you're fighting. Boris, don't leave. Let's all play together. I'll even let you be the one to play first. Can I play? I'm really tired of just sitting alone. I agree. I've got a really good idea. We should stop fighting over stuff and play together instead. <laughs> Looks like the game is at full swing. Have you got room there for two more players? <gasps> Your father and I would be very happy to play the game with you. So awesome! Me wow, me wow, me wow, me wow! The kitty cats realized that it's not that important if you go first or if you win, as long as your friends and family are with you. Mommy's cold. One day, Mommy had caught a cold and had to stay in bed. Here's your breakfast, kittens. Oh, I'm just gonna go take Mommy some porridge and honey and lemon. Our poor Mommy. Being ill is no fun at all. I hope that she gets better really quickly. Well, we could help her feel better. What if we did something really nice for her? Oh, yeah. Maybe by cheering her up, we can make the cold go away. So awesome! Me wow, me wow, me wow, me wow! I once heard Grandpa say that laughter was the best medicine. If we really want Mommy to laugh, let's put on a clown show. <coughs> <laughs> Mommy will laugh so much, she'll get better right away. Hot water bottle to keep your toes warm. Here, have some lovely honey with lemon. Uh, thank you, my darling. Achoo! The kitty cats will now perform the funniest show that you've ever seen. With added laughter medicine. <laughs> la, 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 la. Oh, 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 oh. <laughs> I don't think Mommy's having much fun. Kittens, could the three of you please go play in your room? You shouldn't be near Mommy just now. You don't want to catch her cold as well. Aww. But how are we going to help Mommy if we can't be in the room where she is? We could play a nice concert for her outside. Let's do yeah. it! I've heard that music can make cats feel better. The rain had stopped, and the kittens were ready to start their concert. One, two, three. Let's begin! Darling, what is that strange noise I hear? Um, kittens, could you find a different place to practice, please? Mommy needs peace and quiet to rest. How are we going to do something nice for Mommy if she can't see us or hear us? We could bake her a delicious cake and then bring it to her. But we don't know how to bake a cake pudding. Well, I've watched Daddy do it a bunch of times. The first thing we're gonna need is eggs. And flour, right? Uh, 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 uh. Oh. Oh. Kittens, what was that? Oh, me wow. We were baking Mommy a cake so she'd feel better. We want her to feel so good that her cold goes away. Thank you very much for trying to help Mommy. But for now, we just need to be patient and give her time to get better. And I'll do everything I can to take perfect care of her. It's a real shame I can't make the sun shine for her. 
You're right. Mommy's always really happy when it's sunny out. I have a really good idea. Hmm. Ah. Uh huh? Darling, look there. The sun is coming out. Just look what a beautiful, bright, shiny sun the kittens have made for me. It's really, really cheering me up. I'm beginning to feel better already. Mommy started to feel better, and Daddy allowed the kittens to visit her. Mommy! Oh, how are you feeling now, Mommy? I'm feeling much better. My lovely kittens really cheered me up. And with all that rest and quiet, I'm really much, much better now. So awesome! Me wow, me wow, me wow, me wow! <laughs> oh, darling, sounds like you need some bed rest. I think it's my turn to take care of you for a while. <laughs> we'll draw a rainbow to make you feel better. <laughs> <laughs> the kittens learned that rest and relaxation is the best cure for a cold and a sprinkle of kitten sunshine. Surprise! It was a holiday, National Kittens Day. A special day when parents give their kittens little gifts to celebrate. This Kitten's Day, you'll be getting one big present to share, my kittens, but it's a so awesome ah! one. You'll get your present this evening, but try to be patient. It'll be a surprise. So awesome! Me wow, me wow, me wow, me wow! These kittens just couldn't bear the wait for evening. Look, a delivery truck is delivering something. It must be huge. Wow, <laughs> that box is massive. Our present must be inside. Yep, Mommy <laughs> did say that it would be a big surprise. <laughs> that box is big enough that it might have a complete set of plant encyclopedias. <laughs> so big, it could hold all the parts of a real-life pirate ship. <laughs> all hands on deck! <laughs> Maybe it's a big musical instrument, like a beautiful harp. Well, the box is so big, it could have almost anything inside. We won't find out what it is until this evening. I'll never be able to wait that long. Let's go and take a look inside the box right now. Mommy and Daddy said it's a Kitten's Day surprise. We can pretend to be surprised tonight when we open it. All right, but Mommy and Daddy probably hit the box. We need to find it and be super stealthy, you guys. <laughs> <laughs> the kittens looked all over the house, but they didn't find the box. Where could they hide a box that big? We've looked everywhere in the house. Not down there. <gasps> Let's open it right now! That is a surprise. You think that Mommy and Daddy want to redecorate our room using this giant vase? But it will get in the way of everything. Kittens, the time has come for your present. Your big surprise is waiting in your room. Come find out what it is. Hooray! Hooray! Surprise! All right, lift the box off. I want to see your faces when you see what's inside. I'm not sure I can pretend to be happy and surprised at all. <laughs> we already know there's just a vase in the box. We couldn't help it and had a look inside earlier. We're sorry that we ruined your nice surprise. Why not look inside the box anyway? Maybe you'll still find a surprise. Huh. Whoa! Whoa. Wow, Whoa, look, at, look that. at that! It's a magic town with clocks! 
And it lights up in the dark. That's why we wanted to give it to you in the evening, so you could see it in all its glory. We bought it a couple of weeks ago. The vase is a present for Grandma, but the vase box was just exactly the right size to put your actual present inside and help give all of you a nice surprise. So awesome! Me wow, me wow, me wow, me wow! Thank you! <laughs> <laughs> the kitty cats had a lovely evening with their parents, celebrating Kitten's Day. And they realized that surprises are worth waiting for. Kitty Clothes one day, Mommy was working on her new line of clothes for kittens and ran out of fabric. Kittens, I need to run to the store. If you do need something while I'm gone, ask Daddy in his office. Okay, okay we will, Mommy. I can't wait to see all of the cool clothes Mommy's working on. Why don't we take a look? They're right there in her office. <laughs> hey, it's a kitten-shaped doll, mm. except it doesn't have a head. That's Mommy's catechin. It's a special model shaped like a real kitten to help Mommy make sure the clothes she makes will fit nicely. The coat on the drawing on the wall looks pretty nice, but the one on the catechin here doesn't. Oh, poor Mommy. She had so much to do that she didn't have the time to finish it. Hey, why don't we help her? Let's do it. We'll help make Mommy's coat the best kitten coat ever. So awesome. Me wow, me wow, me wow, me wow. We need to add some pockets and a collar. Cookie, bring us some glue. I will draw the collar and the pockets. After that, pudding, you can cut them out. Someone needs to try it on. Well, professional models are usually pretty tall, and since Pudding's the tallest one, it's pretty clear Pudding should be our model. Go on, Pudding, see how well it fits. Well, I'll try it, but I don't think I can pull off that walk the real models do. Ouch, I can't see anything through this collar. Looks a little bit too high. It really shouldn't cover up your eyes and mouth. We could cut some slits for his mouth and his eyes. I'd only be able to see what's right in front of me, though. What if I needed to look in a direction other than straight ahead? We don't need to cut holes at all. We can just fold the collar down. Cool, good, yeah, that feels a lot better. Mm, except, uh, I can't get my paws into any of the pockets, though. Oh. That's probably because we kind of glued them shut. That's all right. They still make really pretty decorations. We can also glue some pretty buttons onto it and make it the prettiest coat ever. The kittens were so enthusiastic that they covered the whole coat with buttons without even noticing it. Oh boy, now it feels like it weighs a ton. I can't even lift my paws up. I guess it'd be all right to remove a few of the buttons. Oh no, now it's covered in glue, which doesn't make it look pretty at all. What if we covered up the glue with ribbons? <laughs> can't walk in this thing. <laughs> Kittens, what are all of you doing here in my office? And where's the coat that was on the catechin? Mommy, I'm wearing it. We decided to try and finish it. We're, We're sorry, sorry, Mommy. mommy. <laughs> Don't worry, my darlings. That was actually just a practice coat to try things out. I'll make the real thing with this fabric I just bought. And if you would like to help me out, you are all very welcome. So awesome! Me wow, me wow, me wow, me wow! If you practice, or at least that's what they say. And we're learning that the fact is, if you work hard every day, oh, you just won't believe all the things you can achieve. Do your best, let them see all you can be. 
The new coat turned out to be awesome, and the kitty cats were really happy that they got to help their mommy. <laughs> Championship. With only a few more days left until kickoff, you can bet the stadium will be flooded with fans very soon. And here comes our city's own team and their glorious captain. <laughs> Are we going to the stadium, too? Of course we are, kittens. It's the only way to truly support our team. Oh. <laughs> In fact, I was just about to call and book our tickets this minute. We'll get to watch the game right there at the stadium, just like real fans. So awesome! Bee wow, bee wow, bee wow, bee wow! <laughs> we'll get to see our team win. And after the game, we can drive back waving our winning team's flags. No! No! Huh? Uh, uh, oh, no! Oh, what happened, honey? There are no more tickets left. They've already sold out every seat. Oh, all is lost. Oh. It doesn't really matter, my darling. I'm sure we'll survive. We'll just watch the game on television. <laughs> Come now, I'll make some nice tea for you. Poor Daddy, he's such a mega fan. I feel bad for him now. Attention, soccer fans. The contest for the best trick with a soccer ball is now underway. The winner will be awarded an official team ball presented by the captain himself. Hey, we need to win that ball for Daddy because that would really cheer him up. I will now bounce this ball on my head a hundred times. One, two, three, oops. Just a sec. This time for real. One, two, three. One, two, three. One, two. Oh. All right, maybe I can't bounce it a hundred times. Well, maybe you could make just one tricky shot. A super incredible one. Hey, Cookie here. I will now kick this ball through that door. Then it'll roll down the slide on the other side. Cool, let's try. Ah! Ugh. Ouch! I don't think I can do it. I have a really good idea, but to make it work, we'll need a little help from our friends. The kitten's friends agreed to help them perform the ball trick. We ready? Yeah! yeah. All right, let's do it! Now let's send this into the trick shot contest. The next day, they announce the contest winner. And the winner of the trick shot contest huh? is Cat the Artist. Aww. For his creative approach to soccer. He will receive an official team ball from the captain. But we'd also <laughs> like to mention another special video from the Kitty Cats and Friends. No way! They're showing our video! And as a special prize, all these adorable kittens and their parents will receive tickets to the championship game. Awesome! Bee wow, bee wow, bee wow, bee wow! The stadium is completely full today. The home team leads with a score of 2 to 0. The captain power kick. The ball soars high into the air and it's by the way to the hands of the lucky young fan. Watching the championship match and cheering for your team from the stands can be a wonderful experience, especially when you're with your family. Clowning around with Boris. One day, the kittens were talking about what they wanted to be when they grew up. When I grow up, I'm going to be a sea captain. And I'll be a concert pianist. And I, uh, I'll be a great scientist. And I want to be a clown. Hmm? 
Forrest, do you really want to be a clown? You're kind, but not so funny. Well, clowns aren't funny people in real life. They're funny with their bodies when they perform. But you never perform, Boris. You're right. Which means I better start. I'll come up with a funny routine and perform it for everyone. Everyone will laugh a lot. So awesome! Be wow, be wow, be wow, be wow! But at home, the kittens realized that they were worried about Boris. But what if his routine turns out not to be funny? Boris will be so sad if he does a show and no one laughs. What if we sneak and tickle every kitten's paws? Then they're sure to laugh. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Ha ha! <laughs> 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 oh, that won't work. When something's funny, everyone laughs at the same time. We could put this in the audience and play a laugh track on it. Really strange to hear laughter, but not see anybody laughing. <laughs> or you three could help Boris come up with his clown show. Friends are supposed to help one another. <sighs> the kittens want to help Boris with his routine. Oh, thanks a lot for coming. My costume is pretty ready, but I still haven't thought up a funny routine. We can help you with that. Everyone usually laughs when someone falls down. Look, like this. You just drop the banana peel and then you slip on it and fall on your bottom. Go on, you got this. Looks like comedy wipeouts aren't your thing either. Everybody laughs when they hear a funny song, so just sing something hilarious. La la la, la la la. Funny la, songs la. really need to have funny words. But I don't know any really funny songs. Oh, here's something funny to do. Comedy gold, pie in the face, and all you have to do is stand still while I do the rest. You ready? No. <laughs> Well, that was a total waste of a delicious cake. Yeah, and for nothing, because it wasn't even funny. This is all my fault. I'm not funny at all. I won't ever be a real clown. Boris, you're really funny. That's hilarious. Am I? I wasn't trying to be funny. It somehow just happened by itself. <laughs> you know what? I think you really do have the talent to be a real clown. <laughs> I have a really good idea. The kittens came up with a clown routine to showcase Boris's natural talent. And that's how the kitty cats yeah. realize that a talent may not always be easy to see. Sometimes it can even be discovered by accident. <laughs> Tennis with Dad. One day, Mommy was talking to someone on the phone. Uh-huh. All right. Oh, it sounds like a wonderful idea. When would you like to play? Okay, well, I'll see you then. <laughs> And what are you going to be playing, my darling? Well, you and I will be playing together, doubles tennis, with Chase's mom and dad. Whoa! You mean you're going to play a tennis match? So awesome! Be wow, be wow, be wow, be wow! But Kitty, hold on. I'm not really the best tennis player. That's all right. I can pick up the slack for you. We'll play a few sets. Uh, only one set, all right? I've got things to take care of. All right, one set and that's all. Off to the gym. Have to be in great shape for tomorrow. 
Uh, we're going to lose no matter what, and it'll all be my fault. Hey, don't worry, Daddy. You've still got plenty of time to practice. That's right. We can help you, Daddy. The backyard was the perfect place to practice. The key to doubles tennis is to stay out of your partner's way and return the ball. Daddy, just pretend that all of these things are Mommy, and remember to keep away from them. This is Mom, then? <laughs> okay. Mm. Oh, kitty dear, I'm sorry. Oh, oh, pardon me. <laughs> mm -hmm. Ah, oh, that was an accident. Oh, ah! Oh, hey! Oh, no, wait! Oh, 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 oh. Uh. What's wrong? Daddy hasn't hit a single tennis ball yet! He's not moving fast enough to get them. He'd be much faster if he wore a pair of roller skates. But I never figured out how to stop on roller skates. I get in Mommy's way even more like this. Uh, maybe you could just stand in one spot and wait for the ball to come to you. If you did that, you wouldn't get in Mom's way. Hmm. Oh. What if the ball never comes near him? Then it would be like Mommy was playing all by herself. Hmm. <laughs> That's what I'm afraid is going to happen. When it comes to tennis, I'm the worst. <sighs> To cheer everyone up, Daddy offered the kitten some tea along with his signature cake. You may not be the world's greatest tennis player, Daddy, but you make the yummiest desserts ever. Right. Good-looking ones, too. Just look at that icing. Learning how to bake like this took quite a lot of practice. I had to learn the basics first, such as how to whip cream. I've got a really good idea. I know how we can teach Daddy tennis now. Oh. Uh... I thought we were finished with all that tennis stuff. Daddy, there's no need to worry. I promise you'll do awesome this time. <laughs> oh. In tennis, just like in anything else, it's best to start with the basics and eventually move on to bigger things. <laughs> <laughs> We might have won the set, but you guys played excellently. I was surprised. Yeah, you played so wonderfully, darling. Too bad you can't play longer. It'd be great to play some more sets. <laughs> we could play another ten sets. I'm absolutely free until tonight. Awesome! Be wow, be wow, be wow, be wow! <laughs> And that's how simple exercises helped Daddy to believe in himself. Because it always feels good to just try your very best. Ghosts. One day, Mommy and Daddy decided to clean every nook and cranny in the house. While you are carefully vacuuming every rug we have, I will do the window washing. Then we'll do the cellar together. Also, we have to change all of the bedding in the house and wash all the curtains huh? and dust the shelves. Hey, we'd like to help you both with the house cleaning. Really? Are you sure you won't get distracted and start playing? We won't get distracted. We really want to help. Pretty please, Mommy. Okay, now Candy, you can wipe all the dust off all the shelves. While Cookie and Pudding change all the bed sheets in your room, all right? So awesome! Me wow, me wow, me wow, me wow! Wouldn't it just be super awesome to have a big pillowcase race? <laughs> 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 Sure would, but first we have to finish our work, remember? <laughs> hey, Pudding, you look amazing, just like a genuine real-life ghost. <laughs> so do you. I can see you through the sheet. Me too. Ooh. <laughs> <laughs> Don't be 
afraid, Candy. Remember, there's no such thing as ghosts. But I really saw them. Do you think they live in the basement and we disturbed them with all the spring cleaning? <laughs> 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 You're imagining things, sweetheart. We don't need to worry about ghosts. But not having enough time to hang the linens out to dry does worry me. Candy wanted to take a picture of the ghosts and show it to Mommy. Oh, they're not here. Cookie and pudding? Were you pretending to be ghosts this whole time? That's right. Oh, admit it. We really got you. Boo! <laughs> <gasps> How awful! Uh, Mommy, are you that afraid of these ghosts? No, I'm afraid that you have muddied up my nice, clean linens. It was absolutely Cookie and Pudding's fault. They were running around pretending to be ghosts instead of cleaning. You weren't doing your cleaning either. You forgot all about dusting the shelves. Instead, you were just chasing us around. Yeah, and you're the reason we ended up in the puddle and got all muddy. Oh, I just knew you kittens would end up playing and forget all about cleaning. Hey, I know what we should do. We need to finish the jobs that we started, but without any distractions, like ghost chasing. That's a really good idea, Candy. Come on, I'll find some other clean linens for the beds. Mommy, we finished everything! Great, kittens! All that's left is cleaning up the basement. After that, all of our housekeeping jobs will be finished. Uh, 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 it's a real ghost! Uh, <laughs> oh, my kitty! I just found these cool old white curtains in the basement. What should I do with them? These old sheets would be just perfect for dressing up as ghosts. So awesome! Wow! 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 And that's how the kitty cats learned that playing could be even more fun after all the work was done.